Hi there, fifth grade clarinet players. This is a recording of Miss Westwell taking you through a different song in the book that none of you guys have tried yet. So this is going to basically just review things you already know how to do. It's just going to make sure that you kind of work on some finger things, okay? So what you need to do is find page 39 in your book, okay? It's way near the back. If you notice, the page will look green, okay? Once you get to page 39, find 66, and then there will be an A, a B, a C, and a D. We're going to play all of those. They're pretty simple. Um, it's just a pattern, but it's going to work on something with our fingers, that, which is something we've talked about when we learned the A, but I want to just kind of review um, since you have some extra time on your hands, okay? It's kind of a fun one to do. Okay, so 66A, you're gonna notice that every other note is B flat, okay? If you look at the A, if you look at the B, if you look at the C and you look at the D, every other note is your high B flat, the pinch, right? Every good boy, right, third line. So what we're doing is we're practicing going from holes to this pinch, which doesn't use the holes. So what they're wanting us to do is that rolling or sliding a little bit um, our fingers up. So like if I look at 66A, <coughs> excuse me, um, when I go from an F to a B flat, I need to make sure when I go from the F with my thumb to the B flat, well first thing because I have, don't have to have a hole covered here, I need to just go ahead and have him ready to go. Okay, it's kind of just a roll that finger up. So it's going to go from F to B flat. Okay, I'm gonna do that back and forth. I will do the repeats on this. If you notice, every two measures repeat. Check that out, we are, we are gonna do that. And then when I go from the E to the B flat, it's the same thing. I need to have this finger, this thumb, ready to push him down. So it's just a rock, okay? It's not a lift my whole thumb. My, with that first finger in the front to get to the B flat, I just wanna kinda of roll him up to that B flat. Okay? It's just a shift of my, my finger. It's not a lift. Okay, Lifting will slow us down. We talked about this. We did a little bit of this when I taught you guys the A's for like forever ago, it seems like. But um, I just want to review that. So here is 66A. I'm going to do this one twice, and then I'll do B twice, and then C twice, and then D twice. It's just back and forth, guys. It's pretty simple. So here is the F to the B flat first. One, two, ready. <laughs> Here's that again. Now the V, get this finger to ready to, to roll. Ready, V. Same thing again. Now the D, here's. Same thing, D to B. Now the C to the B. One more time. C. So what they're kind of showing you here is that, like when I go from the C to the B flat, it's really still just these two fingers, but it always feels like the more fingers we add, the trickier that is, that lifting up to that B flat. That's a great thing to practice and work on um, here in your spare time. It just really gets your fingers working in the correct way and uh, making sure that we roll that kind of A key on up, okay? There you go, guys. Happy practicing.